here with head coach Mike Jones as we get ready for uh, probably the longest road trip in Lincoln history. So Blue Tigers get ready to take on uh, Central Washington in Ellensburg, Washington this weekend. Uh, you had a long road trip last weekend. You were at Indianapolis. Uh, obviously, they're a very good opponent. Um, offensively, uh, held to just two touchdowns. Uh, was, in your mind, was that an execution issue, or were you just playing a very good defense? A little bit of both. I mean, they, they do a great job at University of Indianapolis. Coach Bart does a phenomenal job with their whole team, offense, defense, special teams. They have a good nucleus of guys. They played well against us. We didn't play as well as we needed to, and we and we had the result was what we got. So, you know, I think this week, you know, we, we were licking the wounds a little bit because, you know, we thought we had them two weeks ago in homecoming, we played well, and then we realized that you got to practice well and play well. We practiced, had a good week of practice, but for whatever reason, we didn't carry over what we do in practice into the games. And so I think, you know, we talked on Sunday, you know, we actually watched film about quarter, the whole team. Usually you break up offense, defense, special teams. So we watched the special teams, offense, and defense the first couple of series, just everyone, so everyone could see what everyone was doing right and wrong. And I think it helped us. Well, one guy who put up some pretty good numbers, especially in the second half, was Morris Henderson. I think he had one of the better rushing days against Indianapolis by a player in the GLVC this year. He had 141 yards in that long touchdown score. Uh, how? Let's talk a little bit about his development and uh, how he's been doing this year. I mean, Morris on course to break his single season rushing record. Um, he's been playing well. You know, you think about it. Uh, we lost four offensive linemen last year. You know, we've had we've played six different guys. And um, and they still done a solid job up front of opening up holes. But the thing about Morris is Morris has some uh, breakaway speed and game changing ability. So you know he gets a crease and, and this is just like the Indianapolis game, an uh, eight yard run turns to a seventy one yard touchdown. So you know that's the type of player he's a big time player and he's done a good job for us. All right. Well, like I said, this is. I think the longest road trip in Lincoln history, uh, going off to the other coast and uh, going to a state where uh, I'd have to check again, but I'm pretty sure we've never played in Washington before. So what kind of opportunities are there for this team in a trip like this? Well, you know what? I think the, the biggest thing was this. You know, originally we, we thought we talked to Central Washington about playing. We backed away and we talked to Dr. Rome, and Dr. Rome thought it would be a great you know, opportunity for us to a recruit to I mean, you're talking about kids at Division Two traveling on an airplane to um, uh, Central Washington play a game and, and traveling back. So, you know, a lot of times uh, I know I've, I've talked to at least seven guys that have never uh, flown on a plane. So, you know, you talk about a lot of guys, it's their first time ever experience of playing on a plane and, you know, playing against a good team in Central Washington. They've traditionally been a good team. So this is a great trip for us, great opportunity for both the coach staff, the staff that's coming, and also the team. You kind of hit on this, but what's uh, the excitement level of the players like? You know, today we had, like I said, we had a team meeting today at 11 15, and like I said, just, you know, guys are excited about flying, you know, because like I said, a lot of these guys haven't flown before. Uh, so we get they get an opportunity to get on a plane, see what it's like to fly to, you know, for four hours. And that's ironic because this is your first trip and you're going to fly four hours. That's you get broken in pretty quick, so it's a good opportunity. And, and like I said, I think it's a little, a little excitement because of nervousness, and then the newness, and also not knowing a lot about Central Washington because we we haven't played them recently, if at all. Well, no, this will be the first meeting against uh, Central Washington, and uh, I know that you've probably been studying them on the film. They're a team that really uh, likes to pass the ball. Their quarterbacks put up some pretty good numbers. Uh, what's going to be the key to stopping that attack? Well, you know what? We, we have to make sure we get our, our linebackers in, in their coverage when we play in zone. We play in man to man, we know we got to make sure we know who we have in, in that situation and cover those guys. And we also got to control the quarterback. The quarterback does a good job of scrambling. He's a good player. You know, when he, like I said, he has the opportunity to run the ball, he'll run the ball. So, you know, they're a good football team. You know, they play some pretty good teams. They're 4 and 4. So, you know, we're, it's a good opportunity for us to match up against a team that, you know, that's good, that's on the road. and and it gives a chance for us to play a good football team. Well, it's going to be a long road trip. You've got the flight. You've got the trip from the airplane to, from Seattle to Ellensburg. You've got, uh, obviously, playing uh, an opponent you're not very experienced with. There's a lot of kind of intangibles that in play here. Uh, working through all that, what's going to be the key for the Blue Tigers to have some success this weekend? You know, the, the first thing is we travel well. We need to learn how to travel well. And what I mean by that is no distractions, No one. everyone's on time. You know, enjoy your teammates, you know, because this, this is the opportunity to bond your teammates. We got a two-hour trip to Kansas City to the airport. You know, then we have lunch and dinner, excuse me, uh, uh, lunch there. 
then we have another hour and a half to wait at the airport, then we have a four hour trip, then we have another two hours to where we're going. So you know you got a good time, you know, this might be the first time other than training camp where you're going to spend an extended period of time, not, you know, two hours on the practice field and maybe 35 to 45 minutes in, in the meeting room. You know, you have some extended time to know, to get to know your teammates a little bit better, you know, and, then, and also get concentrated on who we're playing against. You know, know the game plan, so you have some time to do some different things to prepare yourself to play the game. All right, Coach. Well, good luck this week. Thank you.